unrest in Uzbekistan caused deaths and injuries. The protests in Karakam, Pakistan, which broke out over plans to curtail the region's autonomy, were the worst bout of violence in the Central Asian country in 17 years. 18 people were killed and 243 wounded during unrest in Uzbekistan's autonomous province of Karakam, Pakistan, last week, Uzbekistan authorities said on Monday. Security forces detained 516 people during the protests, which broke out over plans to curtail Karakam, Pakistan's autonomy, but have now released many of them, the National Guard Press Office told a briefing. Karakam, Pakistan situated on the shores of the Aral Sea for decades, an environmental disaster site, is home to the Karang Kampaks, an ethnic minority group whose language is distinct from Uzbekistan, although related. Official reports said protesters had marched through the province capital, Nukus, last Friday and tried to seize local government buildings. According to the Prosecutor General's office, 18 people died from grave wounds sustained during the clashes. Russia's RIA news agency quoted the head of the National Guard as saying the town included 14 civilians and four law enforcement officers. Two exiled opposition politicians in contact with people on the ground told Reuters that they believed the real figure was much higher. It wasn't possible to independently establish the death toll. Eman Sagidulev, Norway-based leader of the pro-independence Angel Karakampakstan Pari said that Karakampaks are not Uzbekistan's. They have their own traditions, culture, and law. This is BBS News, a channel provides you with the latest information from all over the world. See you in the next videos. Bye!